Hi everyone, I'm Adam. I'm Candy. Today we are at the Brownstone. Yeah, Candy, do you know why this project is called the Brownstone? Well, the designer of this project got inspired by the rustic charm of brownstone houses in New York when he was actually conceptualizing the project, giving rise to what we see in the brownstone today. This project is developed jointly by CDL and TID Private Limited. In Singapore, CDL is a renowned developer and has developed over 36,000 luxurious homes such as the Sail and Marina Bay and St. Regis Residences. The Brownstone itself TOP in 2017 and MOP just recently in October 2022. You have a total of 638 units across 8 blocks comprising of 2, 3, 4 and 5 bader units. So just to give you a brief overview of all the 3 bathers in the Brownstone itself, we have some units along Canberra Drive. These units are situated right at the main entrance, hence it is expected that there will be higher noise and activity level. Moreover, these units are facing an open space that has been zoned for residential during development of the plot, which will typically last for 3 to 4 years. The units here will have to put up with noise and dust from the construction. As we move to the units located along Canberra Link and Canberra Lane, we can see that they are situated right next to the MRT track along the main road and also near the common facilities of the development. Hence, you can expect certain noise and activity level if you reside in these stacks. For those internal facing units, we will expect these stacks to command a higher premium in terms of pricing as they are pool facing. If you are someone who is looking for a unit that is more quiet facing, our unit might be suitable for you. Our unit faces Visionaire and is located along the internal road. There are a total of 5 stacks that has this facing. Stack 3 to 6 are at block 150, while stack 15, where our unit is located, is the only stack at block 152. We are situated furthest away from Visionaire, giving you utmost privacy and you can also expect more airflow into your unit. Now I'm going to dive into our unit which features a corner 3 bader unit sitting at 980 square feet. What sets this unit apart from other layout in brownstone is such that the main door does not open up straight into your living space. If you are someone who likes privacy, you do not have to spend extra to construct a panel in order to enjoy Enjoy the extra privacy. Without any further ado, let's have a look. This is a neat rectangular living space. You'll have plenty of natural lighting coming into your unit and even into your dining area as it is being set up right next to the window. As for the living space, it can comfortably fit a 3-seater sofa and with decent distance to the TV where you can enjoy your favourite movies with your loved ones. Something which I would like to point out is that there is no fixture being done up by the current owner so you can reposition all your furnishings freely without having to tear down anything. Now let's move on to the balcony. The balcony is squarish and spacious. You definitely can have your alfresco dining over here, which can easily accommodate 6 to 8 packs. What I love about this balcony is that it has direct access to the kitchen and let's head to the kitchen. As you come into the kitchen, you will see two rows of countertop space for you to prepare your food and also to do your cooking. Top and bottom cabinetries allows for plenty of storage. Right at this corner, we have a space for your washer. Over here, you can find your hob, your hood as well as a built-in oven. All these are still in very good condition. The configuration of this unit is set up as though there is an outdoor kitchen space linked to the balcony. This comes in particularly useful when you do heavy cooking since there will be plenty of ventilation when the space is open up. This is one of the common rooms. Down here what we have is this wardrobe provided by the developer, nicely laminated in and out. So there's no built-in here and you can easily configure it to your own liking. Both the common rooms share the same layout.
So we've come to the highlight of the house, which is the master bedroom. Down here, you're fitted with a bigger wardrobe over here. And then for the bed, actually the owner has fitted it with a king size bed with two bedside table. There's still plenty of space around the bed. Right at the corner here, you have this master end suite which is really luxurious in terms of size. There's also plenty of countertop space that can double up as vanity top. And over here, you have a large window to allow for natural ventilation. Let me touch on the location analysis for the brownstone. The brownstone is located along Canberra Drive and it's well connected to the SLE, CTE and the upcoming North-South Expressway. Canberra MRT is merely 6 minutes walk away and the walkway to the station is completely sheltered. For all your shopping, dining and daily needs, the brownstone is surrounded by three malls, Canberra Plaza, Sambawang Shopping Centre and Sun Plaza which are all located under a kilometre away within walking distance. If you are a parent and thinking about enrolling your kids in a school nearby, within one kilometre, you have Sambawang and Wellington Primary. Within one to two kilometres, you have Chongfu, Ahmad Ibrahim, Canberra, Endeavour, Jiaming, North Oaks, Sishan and Yishun Primary. We have come to the end of the home tour. If you are looking for a beautiful unit that is in a ready to moving condition, this might be the perfect home for your family. We're in the Brownstone, a newly MOP project. Once again, my name is Candy. I'm Madam. We're from Prop Next. Reach out to us for an exclusive viewing. See you soon! soon.